This is Jeremy from HockeyReviewHQ.com. In this video, we're doing a review of the Hockey Slide Board. The Hockey Slide Board is a training tool used by a lot of hockey players to replicate that feeling of skating right in your own living room. A lot of hockey players use this from amateur all the way up to pro. Pretty cool tool, and we're going to do a full review of it right now. So I'm just going to show you what it looks like and what you get in the bag. So we're doing a review of the Power Slide Slide Board. And this is what you get here. So it comes with this end piece. It's got a stopper right there for when you slide this way, it'll stop you. And it's got this rubber grip right there. I assume that it's best to set up on a wood floor so that would grip a lot better. I'm just using carpet, we'll see how that works. And then that's the slide board, so it's fairly long, you can see. And then all the way down here, you have an end piece. So this is an adjustable end piece, and it's just like the other one with the rubber stop and the rubber stop right there for the floor. And you can slide it all along there to make it shorter or longer so depending on how powerful your stride is and then it also comes with these little booties that you put on your feet so that's it that's what you get it fits nicely in that bag right there and I'm just gonna set it up and then start using it and show you what it lo looks like so there you go I have the end piece attached now all you have to do loosen that up and then the slide board will fit right underneath and then you just tighten them up to clamp it so that's set up. I left a little ex excess there just to give myself a short stride. And that's what you got. And now you just have to put these little booties on to help you slide. So put them on your feet and I'm just going to put those on and then show you how it works. Got the booties on my feet and you can see it's nice and slippery. You can do like a moonwalk on here or something. <laughs> and I'm just going to show you how it works now. Just going side to side. And I have to use this on a wood floor. It works really good on the wood floor. Let's see how it works on the carpet. Works good on the carpet, and the more powerful your stride is, the further apart you can move the stoppers. And I can already feel it working right there, inner thighs. And this is really good to work on using your edges and actually pushing out. Because a lot of players, when they first start, go like that and they're just running, they're not using their edges. So this teaches them to push with each stride, and it's pretty cool. But you might think just going back and forth forever might get a bit boring. So I've got something else really cool that I like to use this for. So we're going to head outside and I'll show you. Here's a cool application that I found for the slide board. I set it up right next to my hockey shooting pad. This is a roll-up one. It's 4 by 8 very long, and it's about the same length as the slide board. So it's really cool. You can set it up and it's like you're skating while you're stick handling and shooting. So I really like that. I'm just going to show you what it looks like. Uh, one problem that some players find is that they can't transfer their off ice skills when they practice shooting and stick handling. It's hard to transfer to on ice. So I find this brings it a bit closer having that skating motion. It brings it a bit closer to feeling like you're actually on ice. So I'm just going to set the video camera up. I'll show you what it looks like. Just taking a few shots here going top right inside post. And I like having a slide board there because it's emphasizing to use your legs and push off into the shot. Getting that weight transfer and not just using your arms. I think that's great for players to learn to do that. And a lot of players will just stand still and the slide board helps them get moving and weight transfer. Here I'm just doing some stick handling using uh, two pucks and doing figure eights. So once again the slide board helps add a new dimension. You get the lateral movement, you're going back and forth, you can pull the puck in towards your body as you're sidestepping. And right here to emphasize it I'm just setting the pucks up so it's like I'm stick handling underneath the player's stick. And whenever I do this move, I always have to sidestep the player, so you pull the puck in quickly under the stick, move to the other side. So I really like the slide board for that. It just adds that new dimension of lateral movement, and it's great to practice those types of moves when you have to sidestep the player. Here I'm just going to tee up a few slap shots. And once again, this is a great way to emphasize the weight transfer, because a lot of players, when they learn off ice to take a slap shot, they use all arms. This teaches them they have to push off that back leg, really lean to the shot, use their, their core muscles, so I really like that about the slide board. So it would help build the slap shot for sure for younger players who might not be learning properly. So here's another tee up. And now I'm just going to talk about my overall thoughts of the slide board. Overall, I enjoyed using the power slide. I think it's a great training tool for beginner hockey players who want to work on their skating in the privacy of their own home. I think that's pretty cool because what it's going to do is help emphasize that you have to use your edges and you have to push off to really get that power. So I think that would really help some players understand that and it would help you improve your skating. So if you're a beginner hockey player, I would recommend it. 
Uh, for me, I'm already a pretty good skater, so when I was using it inside the living room, it was okay, it was a little bit of fun, but after a while it got kind of old. So for me to really enjoy it, I took it outside, I put it with a roll-up hockey shooting pad, and I just loved it. I think it's really cool because sometimes when I was out there practicing, it's a lot of fun with the roll-up shooting pad, but you're standing still, so it's not the best, and obviously hockey is way better. But when you add the slide board, you have lateral movement, and there's so many more things that you can do with it. So you can practice your lateral movement, your quick deeks, sidestepping players. For shooting, you can really push off your back leg and get that weight transfer going in. So I really think that it helps take your practicing, your off-ice practicing, to a new level. Some players complain about not being able to take what they learn off-ice onto the ice. I think that a slide board would help bridge that gap because you're adding that weight transfer, the lateral movement, and I really think would help players improve their game even more by practicing with the slide board and the roll-up shooting pad. From a price standpoint, there's two versions. There's an 8-foot and a 10-foot. The 8-foot version is $149.50, and the 10-foot version is just $10 more. I would say just grab the 10-foot version right off the start, because if you need that extra space later on, when you're a bit better and you can slide further, then it's going to be there. And there's also a little DB that comes with it. I thought that was cool, and it's got little workouts that anybody could do. So even if you're not into hockey, say you have some parents that want to use the board, they can use it for that. So I thought that was pretty nice as well. And if you want to get the power slide, just check out the link in the video description or just head over to hockeyreviewhq.com. We have a lot more reviews of hockey products that I'm sure you're going to love. So thanks a lot for watching the video, guys, and we'll see you at hockeyreviewhq.com.